the number of battles that come to your doorstep will reduce. You will have very little battles to fight. You will be bringing tremendous amount of value in your life and in everyone's life that's around you. Let me share with you three consciousness laws of chaos and order. The first consciousness law is that your state is responsible for either chaos or order. Now your state communicates to this vast field of consciousness and what is consciousness? Consciousness is a field of energy and it is life. It is present within us, it's present around us, and it's present in this world and this entire universe. If your state is a bad state, if you are living in a state of anger, fear, guilt, insecurity, then your state is communicating to this field of consciousness that you are not fine, and hence it is opening up doors for chaos in your life. It will open up problems in relationships, you will have problems in finances, you will have problems in health, you will have problems in various aspects of life. But if you learn to live in a connected state, in a state of love, peace, compassion, courage and passion, then you are opening up doors for order in your life. Because your beautiful state then communicates to this vast field of consciousness that you are bringing beauty to life. When your state is communicating something like that, when your state is communicating that you are in a beautiful state, every aspect of your life starts to fall in order. Order starts to come into every aspect of your life. Where you had problems, they will start to disappear. Where you did not find solutions, you will start to find solutions. The second consciousness law of order and chaos. If you are living your life, which is totally about oneself, which means it's only about you, and you're totally disconnected from everyone around you, and you really do not care for the joy and the well-being of the other, living in this way, which is all about me and I, will bring about a lot of battles to your doorstep. It'll bring battles in your relationship, it'll bring battles in your wealth creation, it'll bring battles in your health, it will bring battles in your business, in your professional life. In every aspect of your life, you will start to face battles. But if you can live a life which is inclusive, where you are concerned for the other's well-being, where you are connected with the other, where you clearly understand that other's joy is also your joy, the number of battles that come to your doorstep will reduce. You will have very little battles to fight. You will have beautiful relationships. You will create wealth in a beautiful way. You will have a wonderful health. And the third consciousness law of chaos and order is that when chaos sets into one aspect of your life and you do not resolve that, then that chaos will start spreading into every other aspect of your life. Let's take an example of health. You have extremely good health when your body is communicating in perfect harmony. The way your kidneys function, the way your liver functions, your heart, your brain, your nervous system, everything is functioning beautifully when there is a perfect harmony in communication. But if diabetes sets in, it throws the entire communication into chaos. And that single chaos starts to produce multiple diseases. So diabetes can cause heart disease, it can cause tumors, it can cause kidney failure, it can cause liver failure, it can cause cancer. Every aspect of your health can be thrown to chaos. In the same way, if chaos sits into one aspect of your life, let's say in, in relationships, then that chaos will manifest itself in every other aspect of your life. It will spread itself like a disease to other aspects of your life, to wealth creation, to relationships, to fulfilling your desires, to solving problems, to your business, to everything. But if you're able to bring order to one aspect of your life, 
then that order will automatically set itself into motion into every other aspect of your life. Following these three consciousness laws is very important for one to have a magnificent, beautiful life.